No, this is not clickbait. ChatGPT can talk now. Hey, I can talk now, and I have different voices. So we're going to learn everything that's involved with this new update when it comes to the desktop version, the different voices, and everything above the board. Now, some of y'all in the comments might be saying, Corbin, we already had this feature. This was part of the mobile app, but what's cool now is we can actually do this within the desktop version. Personally, I rarely use the mobile version. I am more inclined to use the desktop version. I think it's just part of my workflow. Hey, Corbin. And yeah, hey. I know you can hear me. Let's talk. Okay, I got it, ChatGPT. Let's let's get into this video then. In this video, we're going to go over the different voices that are available in this feature. Also, I'm going to see if there's any nuance here where I can basically tell it to maybe delay how it talks, you know, maybe, you know, take a breath, whatever it may be. We're going to see everything we can do with this new voice feature. This is my Twitter. Description down below. Click the link. Click follow. Let's jump in today's video. First things first, let's find out how to even choose the voice it talks with. We're going to go ahead and click our sidebar here. We're going to go to our personal account. We're going to hit settings. In settings, we're going to simply click speech. And we have the option for five different voices. Let's go ahead and just do a joke with each one and see what it sounds like. Let's start with Sky. You put in the prompt. Tell me a joke that would be used in Comedy Central. Here's Sky. Why don't scientists trust atoms anymore? Because they make up everything. Okay. <laughs> Let's try out Breeze. What do you call fake spaghetti? An impasta. An impasta. Okay, not bad. That's Breeze. Cove. Why don't oceans ever go out of business? because they always have a steady flow of current. That was a horrible joke. Also, <laughs> too serious of a voice, but that's Cove. Ember. Why did the pizza maker bring a small suitcase to work? Because he wanted to pack a little slice of home. Okay, ChatGPT, that is not, I don't even think that's a joke. Maybe that is, I don't know, but that's Ember. Juniper. Why don't scientists trust atoms when they go on vacation? Because they make up everything. All right, so that is all the voices. All the voices gave us very corny jokes, but now you have an idea of the voice selection. Let's go ahead and see if we can push them to the limits here and kind of like speech patterns. Okay, tell me a story where the first part is said urgently and the second part is said in a calm manner. So, I have no clue if this is going to work. I'm thinking it's probably not going to work. Let me go ahead and add a little bit more context here. Let's say shorter and add context for the part that is urgent and the part that is calm. So it's still not understanding. What I want here is I need to be very, very specific here. So maybe I can do like no place like this, urgent, semicolon, semicolon, and then calm, semicolon, apostrophe. All right, so this is what I'm thinking here. Let's see if the speech is able to recognize it or if this if it's like the same type of speech, right? Like if it's the same like, level of you know breaths per minute speech pattern everything boom urgent emergency the dam's about to burst grab what you can and head for higher ground now shouted Whoa. mayor thompson through the megaphone his Jeez. voice cutting through the panic-stricken okay. town people dashed frantically gathering loved ones and essentials as the sound of the sirens echoed ominously against the rumbling of the approaching floodwaters calm it's over folks Mayor Thompson announced with a gentle smile, weeks later, as the community gathered in the town hall. Thanks to our quick action. So it can, a little bit. I mean, the now actually like basically blew out my eardrum. I wasn't expecting it to get like that intense, but it does seem to be able to understand and change the speech pattern. So it isn't just like completely monotone throughout. That's pretty powerful. That covers the speech feature that is available on the desktop version of ChatGPT. If you like this kind of video, you can check out the playlist at the end here. I'm gonna leave a playlist where we're looking at GBTs and everything we can do with GBTs. Make sure to leave a like. It's completely free. It helps me out here. I'll see you in the next video. That's the playlist I was referring to. There is probably over 30 or 40 videos in that. That's a random video. That's my face. Something may or may not happen when you click it. I don't know.